I've been painting for as long as I can remember. My perspective as an artist informs my perspective on the entire world. Starting a painting, that is usually the most exciting part. Kind of the scales fall off my eyes. I'll start to see things completely differently. There are objects, people, places that just have this pulsating vibrancy. Steamboat Springs is certainly a town like no other. I am so lucky to have spent 20 years there. It has this sense of closeness and yet this great expansive worldview. Greg was one of the main reasons the gallery started in the first place. Right away, I fell in love with his style, with his ability to see something which we walk by every day maybe and we don't notice. Objects in his pieces, they acquire a different life. They have a soul and you recognize the beauty that you haven't seen before. I got this call for artists from Steamboat Creates and they were asking for a mural in Steamboat Springs to represent all of the arts in the Yampa Valley. And I was thinking about Steamboat Springs where I really grew up and learned to paint and learned to play the piano. It, it was just, it was right here. It hit me really hard. Steamboat Creates wanted to expand the scope of our mission by bringing art from inside of a building to the outside of the buildings so everyone can experience art. Public art is so important because it expresses the community and the feelings of the community. There's an energy. People are out walking around. Even on the, on the worst snowy evenings with two feet of snow, people come out to support the local artists and the downtown businesses are opening up their doors to the community to share. Having art around and having high visibility is a wonderful thing. I think it's great for the community to have that kind of a reputation. It's our history. Perry Mansfield's been around for over 100 years. The Chief's pushing 100 years. People have been coming to this valley for arts and entertainment longer than they've been coming here for recreation. So I, I feel that arts are, are just ingrained in who we are as a community. When they first approached me about doing this mural, I, I at first was a little apprehensive, but certainly then realized, no way, this is like a new gallery. I began to bring together, you know, this violin that I'd found. It's meant to represent Strings in the Mountains, where I used to go with my family all the time to see concerts. I took piano lessons at Perry Mansfield. That was quite important to me, so I incorporated a couple old photographs of the founders of Perry Mansfield. Of course, the painter's palette for the visual arts, and all of these objects are floating above this kind of sunset cloudscape, which to me is a representation of the way in which the arts can kind of bring us above the fray, if you will. One of the most rewarding things about having that mural that Greg did on our building is to see people walking by, stop, look at it, and then engage in a conversation. To see people pause and lift their head up and take their daily blinders off for just a moment, it gives me so much joy.